Hi, I'm Janae Meadows of JanaeMeadows.com. Today I'm going to show you how to use the uh, eyedropper tool and the measure tool in Illustrator. So your little eyedropper tool is down underneath the mesh. Looks just like an eyedropper like you'd suppose. And you hit I if you want to bring it up. So I'm going to do that. You can also tear this off and you'll see underneath him is your measure tool. So let's just pop those both out here. You can zoom out. There you go. There's those two. Quite the team. So we need something to eye drop. So let's open up a Mahalo logo here. And I want to uh, be able to pick that same color from this photo. Let's say I want that same exact blue. I just click the eyedropper, click the M, and I've sampled it. So it just samples. Like I want to sample this yellow. Sampled. That's what that does. Okay, the measuring tool is just what you think it is. It's a ruler. It looks just like a ruler. Let's go in there. I'll show you it. Click on him. And now, just watch this. Click and drag. It'll bring up a little info box for you. And you can measure on an angle if you want to. And you can just measure any way you want. Just click and drag. I want to know how long that pedal is. Click and drag. And it comes up right here in your nifty little box. Well, I hope that explained the eyedropper and the measuring tool for you. If you want to see what I'm up to, go to JanaeMeadows.com. And be sure to check out some of my other tutorials I got going on here.